Hey everyone, so today we are doing a uh, tour of my uh, makeup collection um, and what's on my vanity or my makeup table and all that. We're not going to go straight into like really a lot of depth into the products because there is a lot so this video would be like a million years long. So yeah, alright let's get started. First to my vanity, this is what it looks like. And I have some lights on here and some lights up there on my mirror. I have my headbands here, so my cat ear headbands and my unicorn horn headband. I have some skincare stuff up here. I have some of my powders and my beauty blender and the beauty blender holder in here. I have some stick highlighters. I have some pot eyeliners and some concealers. Then underneath that I have my lip balms and some tape. Then right under there I have this little two set of drawers. So in here I have some single shadows. These are more of my neutral ones. So more neutral, just like shimmery and mattes and just stuff like that. And then the bottom one I have singles of like colorful ones. And this here, this has my brow stuff in it and my brow shapers. Um, heated eyelash curler, some lip primers, eye pencils, lip pencils, some more brow stuff. Um, mascara, some color correcting concealer, and then right beside this, I have my NYX eyeshadow base right here, my Dip Brow by Anastasia Beverly Hills, eyelash curler, some loose powder right in the back there, my sharpener. In here right now, I just have some lashes that I just got that I have to put into um, my lash storybook. And back here, I have all my mascaras back there. And here I have some primers, some concealers, more primers, eyeliners, and uh, two brushes here, my nose contouring brush and this flawless concealer brush by e.l.f. Um, I also have my new Stila here and my Stila One Step Correct uh, primer. And my eyeshadow primers are all in here too. Now to over here. Here I have this little thing that has um, a little bit of my one of my eye pencils left, uh, some lash glue, um, my tools, so like some scissors, a spoolie, um, tweezers, stuff like that. And then over here I have some colorful pencil eyeliners and white pencil eyeliners. These are all like liquid eyeliners. And then over here I have my mirror um, that lights up. Right now it's kind of dead, but yeah. I put batteries in it. And then I have my little penguin here. Some more skincare. In this drawer here, I have some um, small eyeshadow palettes. So I have my Quo one, my Smashbox cover shot, some Maybelline ones, um, some of my stick lipsticks, and these two things that I got in a subscription box that I'm going to use on a first impression video. And right above that, I have this gorgeous palette isn't great for traveling but it is gorgeous it looks like a music box so i have that right under there with my little with my little dream decor and my ring holder and on top i have some more eos lip balms i have this little canvas that says slay the day mac lipsticks um some of my anastasia beverly hills liquid lipsticks um too faced bite beauty and uh, ColourPop lip glosses. Then we go over here, and these are my little mugs that I love. This one says, All my children have paws, because you know I have four cats, which I miss very much. <laughs> and I have all my brushes here. So I have this I have a Too Faced one, I've got some drugstore ones, I've got some e.l.f., Quo, Jolie Couture. Um, more Quo, my Urban Decay, bougie ass brushes, and my cute little bee mug. And I have some flat foundation brushes in here, except for my Urban Decay one, it's, that one is just with this. 
Back here I have more um, e.l.f. brushes. I have some eye drops right there. And this holds all my eye brushes. So all my eyeshadow brushes like that, eyeliner and all that fun stuff, including my Urban Decay ones. And then uh, behind these are more brushes. So this is my Quo professional brush set. I typically use these occasionally and most of the time it's usually just for special effects makeup. And then in this box that I made, a long time ago, has some pressed powders. And now we have a drawer here, which I love because it looks like it's not a drawer, but it's nice. Um, so here I have my blushes. I have some shimmery blushes here, bronzers, a little eyeshadow palette there, my bronzers here. And I have my All Nighter by Urban Decay, the waterproof setting powder. I have this Urban Decay palette, face palette here. It's like that. And I have this Quo face palette here. Um, and then beside it, I have this Anastasia Beverly Hills lip gloss. It's still in the box, I haven't used it yet. Um, these L'Oreal Drugstore Loose Pigments. This Urban Decay Alice Looking Gloss Lipstick to the uh, Hi-Fi Shine Lip Glosses by Urban Decay. And here I have um, another pigment, a Kat Von D pigment and this cool one. I have this Makeup Forever Aqua XL color paint in shade M24. I have my glitters, little stones, and then right behind there I have this, which was originally the packaging for these but I use them for all my palette eye brushes from just like oh, mostly Urban Decay. Some ends of Beverly Hills in there as well, just because they are dual ended. So I don't want to put them in like one of those because it'll ruin whatever sides on the bottom. So I just have them in here. And then here I have this Kat Von D Shade and Light Contour Eye Brush. And so this is what it looks like. I love the packaging. It's a little like not space saving but it's really cute so and then I have this Tarte Rainforces C dual ended um, foundation brush right in here I just have it right on top there and over here I have some of my single highlighters so I have my little dual contour brush that I use for putting down a base for my highlighters I have this Dandelion Twinkle by Benefit uh, Wet n Wild Highlighting Powder this Maybelline Fairy Highlight uh, Highlighting Powder, uh, this NYX Dual Chromatic Powder, some ColourPop Super Shock Highlighters, this e.l.f. Uh, Shimmering Facial Lip, and I have this Elizabeth Arden um, Liquid Highlighter, and over here I have these two Maybelline Highlighting Sticks, um, Maybelline Highlighters here. Too Faced highlighter, more Too Faced, and a Too Faced bronzer. I have my little Cover FX mini here. I have my Benefit What's Up Cream highlighter and my NYX Away We Glow highlighters. So I'm just gonna close this and move on to down here. This stuff is just like hair supplies and jewelry. My hair brushes over here, my uh, hairspray. I have some other skincare stuff back there. Some of my makeup towels. Over here I have these two set of drawers that have some drugstore face stuff and that that I didn't need in my big pink thing here. So let's just look at that. So then if I'm doing a drugstore tutorial, I can just go right to here, don't have to scramble to find stuff. And here is all my palettes and my lash story, full of lashes. So we have this NYX Advent Pop, got some Physicians Formula Bronze Booster um, Contour Highlight and Bronze Palette, um, Maybelline Contour, L'Oreal Contour. Some Anastasia Beverly Hills Glow Kits here. A NYX Strobe of Genius Glow Kit. Kat Von D. Metal Crochet Alchemist. So a Huda Beauty Palette here. A Quo Eye Palette. Some NYX ones here. Um, Tarte Toasted. Uh, Too Faced Just Peachy. 
I have some Urban Decay ones here. There's Moon Dust, Electric Palette, After Dark, G. Michael Bisque, Palette Color Pop, Semi Precious. Um, this one I got in the mail. Uh, this one is a drugstore one that I have here. It's a colorful one. Back here I have these Too Faced ones and another Urban Decay one down there. I have the Sephora Ombre Obsessions palette. I have the Anastasia Beverly Hills Modern Renaissance and Soft Glam palette. The Kat Von D Shade and Light um, Eye Contour palette and the Serpentina palette by her as well. The Huda Beauty Desert Dusk and Rose Gold Remastered palette. The Too Faced Eurothal Eyeshadow palette. I have the Urban Decay Distortion Eyeshadow palette here. The Sephora like Custom palette. Actually, these ones are the opposite. So this one's the Ombre Obsessions and this one's the Custom. Sorry, guys. But this one here is uh, the Tarte Tartist Pro Amazonian Clay palette. Um, the Zulu palette by Juvia's Place. I have the Urban Decay Vice. Um, Urban Decay Vice XX Reloaded. The Urban Decay Full Spectrum. The Urban Decay Alice Looking Glass palette. The Kat Von D Saint and Sinner. And then these three Morphe palettes, I have the 35OM, 35T, and the 35F. And this other Too Faced palette here. So that's that drawer. Now this drawer. This drawer here, I have more mascaras down there. I have some liquid highlighters and some in here as well. Some primers. I have my setting sprays. Uh, another primer all here too. Some other base makeup, all my foundations and BB creams. Here I have a bunch of lip glosses, and back there some stick lipsticks, um, more lipsticks, um, some liquid lipsticks and glosses there, um, and these are all my liquid lipsticks. Uh, over here I have, this is just some other eye pencils and liquid eyeliners, um, and this is a lip product right here. And I have all my single um, lash sets here, yeah, so that's that drawer, and then the bottom. And then my minis all here. Over here I have some makeup bags. More minis. Over there I have my mini emergency kits by Pinch. I have some empty eyelash trays all here which come in handy. I have some Quo brush cleaning wipes. I have some of my mirrors like compact mirrors down here. Brush cleaner. And special effects um, makeup products. I have more stuff in here that I just use for special effects. It's just like like black and white pencils and stuff like that. I have lots of random sponges, um, cleansing pads for my brushes. Um, all here is just my Beauty Blender cleanser and all of my brush shampoo. Um, I have some more minis in these. I have this Benefit Boing Erase case. It has the mini uh, Boing collection inside in my shade, which is light. Here I have some Quote. Um, makeup sponges, my beauty blender set, and my other beauty blender set here, and that's that drawer. So I guess that's pretty much it then. That's basically it. Um, those lights, they turn on and so did these ones. I'll show you right now. Basically they're here and there. Obviously they'll look better when it's, you know, dark, but just wanted to show you anyways. And yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed my the tour of my makeup collection and my makeup table. Um, if you did, please uh, give me a big thumbs up. It's really helpful. Um, comment down below what what else you want me to do. If there's anything else, like any tutorials or anything, just sound off in the comment section below. And uh, don't forget to subscribe before you leave if you haven't already. And I will see you next time. Bye, guys. Bye.